Now, as we uh, celebrate Women's History Month, we're also highlighting some extraordinary women living seemingly ordinary lives. Yes, one is welder and mother Destiny Prieto of Lancaster. Here's a look at her incredible journey from foster care to a woman thriving in a field usually dominated by men. And now, a day in the life of Destiny Prieto. Destiny is a working mom. Sometimes it's tiring. My kids gotta eat. Her son Angel is one. His big brother X is three. <laughs> Destiny is determined for her children to grow up without the devastating burden she endured. She opened up about her past during her daily commute along Sierra Highway between Palmdale and Lancaster. My whole life, I always felt like I was a throwaway kid. Uh, my mom left when we were really young. And I just always wondered why. Destiny entered the foster care system at 11 years old. This photo collage, her only childhood memento. I, uh, I try to cherish this a lot. It broke, there's no glass on it, um, but everywhere I go, I take it with me. I just never understood what, how a mom can leave their children. Destiny is breaking a multi-generational curse. Every day, she arrives for her shift at the Lost Angels Career Center, where she works to restore classic cars. Not a lot of women do this work. I know, everyone always says that, and everyone always like, you have a man's job. Destiny knows these engines inside and out, and out in the yard, that stores future restorations. Destiny works on building and restoring rusted out classics, their bodies and their frames. Are yours? I don't know, I don't remember. This welded seam, that's her work. I feel like when you're welding, you're just like, you're always doing something with your hands. You always have to, like, you're welding, and if you're not welding, you're grinding. And when she's not welding or grinding, Destiny is teaching. She has a passion for these kids. Because I kind of look at a younger me. Like Destiny, many of these students also transitioned out of the foster care system, which means they are miracles. They're beating the odds. Aging out of foster care is perilous. By 18, one in four are homeless and with little or no family support. They need skills. Destiny learned what she knows here, and now she's paying it forward. That's really good. After work? Uh, we're gonna go pick up my babies from daycare. Uh -huh. uh, one of the biggest reasons why I do do this is for them. Destiny is raising these kids by herself. Her three-year-old is nonverbal. When there's something he needs, I'm so mad that it's just not there. But he tries. Come on, baby. Parenting a child with autism is challenging, but I think the students actually helped me grow as a mom. Um, having having a bunch of people depending on me. You know, and, and just transferring that into my kids. And okay, if I have this much patience for my students, I need to have this much patience for my kids plus more. Destiny's career has given her something she never had growing up, a two bedroom apartment and a stable home. Destiny has never been more exhausted and she has never been more fulfilled. Sharing her life story <laughs> has been cathartic. Destiny now knows that she isn't a throwaway after all. Oh, yeah. <laughs> to her children, she is the mother she always <laughs> wanted. And to her students, she represents an ideal. Someone who once faced their challenges, now using her past to lift their futures. <laughs> Destiny, you are phenomenal. A phenomenal woman, that's wow. for sure. Such a great story there. Right? Wow. Oh, the patience of Joe. 